Oh, right into that curve. What's up guys, got something new here. Uh, this is a little project I've been working on. I, uh, I really miss my uh, you know old Trugified uh, setup, you know, running the 2.8s. And uh, so what I did is I basically took a bunch of spare parts that I had and a bunch of M2C goodies and, and I created this truck. Uh, it's based on the Trugified uh, Typhon uh, uh, platform, uh, although it does have uh, Mojave, Mojave 6S arms, front and rear, along with the turnbuckles and drive shafts. Uh, it just makes for a, for a killer stance. Um, you know, it's about I wish I had brought the other arm to show you, but it's about it's it's kind of in between like a like a crate and outcast and a, and a typhon arm, so it's so it's so it's perfect, gives it the uh, perfect stance. Um, this truck does have it's got a uh, Sentin tires, a uh, Sentin 6S tires and body mounts. It's got hot racing uh, diff cases front and rear. Uh, of course, the M2C chassis. Um, it's got the M2C um, uh, chassis braces. And also, I am trying out these these new um, uh, uh, hinge pin blocks uh, that Mitch has uh, created. It does have uh, locking uh, pins, so it locks on all four corners. So it basically, you know, there's no way you could bust your diff case, especially if you have a plastic one, because it just it transfers the energy around and it just locks it in um, on all four corners. It's a very nice design. Uh, so can't wait to be running those. Uh, this truck is just a complete tank. I mean, it does have uh, it, it does have a stock uh, servo in it right now, because that's just one I just had sitting in my box. Um, but I got uh, 500,000 in, in the center as far as diff fluids, uh, 50, uh, 50 in the front, 30 in the rear. Um, and even though these uh, 2.8 uh, trenchers are unstrapped or untaped, they still don't balloon that bad, um, you know, running that 500 in the center. And also, uh, she's running outcast diffs uh, front and rear, uh, you know, outcast crate and diffs so that I can, you know, if I wanted to, I could run 3.8 tires on it. And this body right here is just an old body that I had sitting in the garage. Uh, I do plan on doing up a new body for it. So, you know, this one's cut out in the back. Uh, but I think it looks pretty cool, you know, just uh, just just for now. Um, and again, uh, real quick, a uh, huge shout out to uh, Woody from the Arma Forum. Yeah, he sent me a bunch of Arma Forum stickers, so uh, I'm definitely gonna be uh, representing those. So, you know, if that's that's a good thing to join. If you guys have any questions, or I mean, there's so many good threads on there and how tos and just a lot of talk, and uh, you'll definitely learn a lot uh, from the forum. So, you know, give. So if you guys aren't a member of that, you know, I'd, I'd check it out. All right, guys, let's give this baby a rip. stump that was a bit rough <laughs> She really gets up and moving. Whoo, that was close. Oh, right into that curb. <laughs> Luckily, she is a uh, M2 Cified. So that's nothing to it. All right, let's give her a little send and see how she holds up.
Oh yeah. Oh, completely missed the ramp. Oh man, that was that was crazy. Hey guys, it's really tough to see this ramp when you're a hundred feet away from it, and you got three feet worth of ramp to hit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, completely missed the ramp again. Oh, lost power. <laughs> oh, that was rough. Oh, like I said, guys, this thing is a beast of control. Just the way I like it. She dropped off. Alright guys, I came out of this little rock pit. I'm at a race against the daylight now. It's getting dark fast, but I just wanted to go ahead and finish these packs out. Just uh just hitting up some different spots with it, different terrains and uh giving it a go so all right let's see what's up oh. She's almost not going to make it. <laughs> that was close. Woo! All right, guys, that was LVC. This thing is a complete riot to drive. <laughs> I mean, this is probably one of the funnest trucks I've driven yet. I mean, it's super stable to be, you know, you know, to be the uh, truckified uh, platform. Even though nothing's really typhing on it, other than the shocks, everything else is just a complete, you know, uh, just mix up of all the 6S rigs. This body's definitely toast. I figured it wouldn't last too long. I need to put a, a brace on that uh, center tower for the for the next body. Um, but this thing was a complete riot. Um, just thoroughly impressed. Got a screw coming out there. But the Mojave arms definitely give her a wider stance. And real quick, uh, I did have to uh, a Dremel back because the Mojave chassis has has uh, shorter ears on it right here. So so in order for these arms not to bind, in order to get the uh, you know the right um, arm travel. I had to kind of dremel off these ears a little bit so the so the uh so the arms could fall down but anyway all right guys this thing was fun and uh we'll get back out again soon until next time rcd81 peace out